Hi there, how's it going? So this Sunday just gone, I was up in Leicester where I had arranged a meetup of Chinese martial arts instructors. This was a, an open meet for people to come together to exchange ideas, do some push hands, do some sparring, whatever people wanted. And before I get into what happened, I just want to give you some background and context as to why it happened. Mike Graves, an old friend of mine from back in the day, a little while ago put up a clip on a, I think it was a Yang Family Tai Chi forum, and it was of me doing a form demo back at an event in the late 90s. I think it was probably one of the events that my old mate Dave Nicholson had organised. He, he used to put on a lot of different events, competitions, that kind of thing. So this sort of three minute clip went up of me doing a form. Some people liked it, some people didn't, that's all fine. But what, then we got this post from someone called uh, Hinkley Tongbei and Taiji Club, who absolutely slated it, really gave it both barrels. Quite a long post, full of uh, vitriol, really. So, okay, fine, you didn't like it, fair enough. But my response generally in that case is, well, show me what you've got and it'd be interesting to see. This, to cut a long story short, descended or evolved into this huge long thread where other people got involved and this guy just got more and more insulting about everything and everyone. He was calling people idiots, all sorts of stuff. It ended basically with him at one point saying to me, I'm going to track you down, me and my teacher are going to track you down and we're going to come and you know teach you a lesson, show you what it's all about. Well, I, tracking me down is quite easy because I'm not hiding. But I've got friends up in Leicester, I've got connections up in Leicester. So I thought, well, let's arrange something up in Leicester, which Hinkley is part of Leicester. And I, I sent him a message saying, I sent him a post saying, we're doing this, you know, you're welcome to come along. So that was really how the idea started. And my way of thinking was you can take this negativity you get on things like social media but if we can get a group of people together, we can get an exchange of ideas, of techniques, of training methods going, then that becomes a positive thing, right? So I got a venue sorted. I posted the details up on various Facebook groups, including ones that uh, Mr. Hinckley frequents. And I'm pleased to say on the day, we got a good crowd of people come along. We had Kwong, we had Andy, we had Steve, we had Alan. Uh, Alan, by the way, runs a YouTube channel called In Defense of Traditional Martial Arts, which is well worth a look. And we had Ed and Chris were there as well. In fact, I just want to say thanks to Ed. It was him who organized the space for us. Uh, Kwong, unfortunately, had to leave early because of work commitments. But we spent a little bit of time chatting and then we got into doing some fixed step pushing hands and some light sparring. As this was a gathering of Chinese martial arts instructors, I went back to really just trying to use my old Tai Chi stuff, which was interesting from my perspective, going back to some of those methods. Anyway, I'll give you a, a little clip of some of the stuff that happened on the day, just a short thing, so hopefully you get something of the flavour of what went on, and then I'll give you my thoughts after that.
I think the first thing to say is, well, thanks for all those guys who came along and there was a very good spirit in the room. Everyone was very friendly, everyone was very respectful, but everyone also was willing to give and take. You know, there were some real good exchanges going on. And for me, it was nice to see this because, you know, if you get enmeshed in these silly uh, social media things, you can sort of think that, uh, what's happening with martial arts, you know? There seems to be very little respect or uh, etiquette or anything these days. So it was nice to be with a group of people who exemplified that, you know? Martial arts is supposed to build character as well, right? So seeing that and getting back in touch with that was very good. And at the end, people were saying, oh, could we make this a regular thing or a semi-regular thing? It's nice just to meet other people, work with different styles and different methods. There's a nice exchange going on. And of course, this is how you learn stuff. You don't learn stuff just by staying at home <laughs> and working with yourself, you know? You have to go out and meet other people. So yeah, from that point of view, it all went really well. I was very happy with it, and I hope all the guys had a good time. As for Mr. Hinckley, you may notice he was quite conspicuous by his absence. Um, I just think it's a bit embarrassing, really. I mean, if I had someone in my organisation who was sort of running their mouth off like that, uh, then sort of threatening to go and sort people out, but then not even turning up when those people come up to do an event on your doorstep, it's, it's really just embarrassing. But perhaps we best say no more about that. That's for him and his teacher to sort out. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the clip. I'm sure there's going to be more stuff coming up. I'm sure Alan's going to put something up on his channel in defense of traditional martial arts. I'll put a link below to check that out. If this is something you'd be interested in attending in the future, do let us know. And this being social media, I'm sure someone's going to look at the, the footage there and say, oh, but you're pushing hands this and you're sparring that. You know, this was a, a, a get together. This is a friendly get together. We're all works in progress. If we do this again in the future, if you've got something you think you can bring to the table, you can offer us, you can show us, then you'd be welcome to come along and join in too. So big thanks to all the guys again. Thanks to Ed for sorting it out. And thanks to Stu at Stu Unique Fitness. I'll put the link down below. Best gym in Leicester. Go and check them out.